Thank you, Jesus. There is a little rainbow right over there. Thank you, Lord, for a beautiful day. For a chance to get out there and go fishing. Lord, I ask that you walk ahead of me and pave the way. And that any fish that we release are released healthy and return back to home and survive. I pray that everyone watching learns, uh, learns something and that today just goes as great as it could possibly go. In Jesus' name, amen. What's up? Kingdom fishing, right? Yeah, how'd you know? I helped you land that steelhead at Rocky River. Oh, you did? Yeah. That's... And I told you to come here because they're spawning? Yeah, and I, you, you just did a video of this place. I did. This bedding uh, bass, right? I did, yep. That was, I think that was a couple weeks ago. Yeah. They're a little finicky today. They're, they're not interested. They look at everything. But... Oh, you gotta like coax them into it, but... You gotta, Kind of like, so you see this one right here? I'm using like a gulp minnow. Uh -huh. And I'll keep putting it, throwing it on his bed. You like see how right now he's staring at it? Oh, and so it, 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 I'll, it. I'll let it sit there a little bit. And then I can't really see right now, but I'll like jiggle it. See how I bounced it and dropped it a little closer? So sometimes they will they'll be really weird and they'll just sit there and stare at it and you kind of just gotta like subtly wiggle it to entice them to bite it but it can be rough but that's usually why I go around the whole lake because some of them are more eager and less eager than others but what I'm using right now that minnow a lot of usually I just fish it like this I catch stuff like crazy a week ago I was here and I, I, I had a bunch of them striking the uh, topwater lure. Did you? See, I had something bite right there, but I didn't hook it. It must have been a bluegill. But yeah, I'm doing my little rounds around the lake. I'm surprised you uh, <laughs> recognized me after so long. That was what? A while ago. Yeah. I appreciate you. I watched your videos because you gave me a card. So. What's this guy doing? See, I see swimming away, so there must have been bluegill coming after him. So I, I have a real life bluegill bait. I'm going to try to throw that, but it's huge. It looks like a real bluegill, though. A 3D printed bluegill. So I'm going to try. That's a decent sized bass right there, too. I'm going to try going around with this, and if I don't catch any, I, I'm kind of eager to try that while they're spawning. It might, they might hit it hard, because that's what they're, like, fighting with right now. It's not that, but it's not that they don't want to defend their bed against your lure. They're kind of more worried about bluegill right now. Yeah, they're defending their bed. Yeah. They're not really hungry. But I would think the males are still out there. Well, the males, so it would be the females out there feeding. It's the males that guard the bed. Oh, the males are guarding? Yeah, isn't that weird? <laughs> I think the female digs the bed, though. I I was watching some the other day, like, the I think it was the female. She was swimming down and, like, rolling her belly all over the bottom to clean it up. That was kind of cool. Like, there's a giant crappie right there.
I got a bluegill and I'm stuck in a tree. Wow, that's a big bluegill, guys. Holy cow. Come on, line. There we go. Holy cow. That is a fat bluegill. Look at that. Am I tearing it hard? I think I can look. Look at this bluegill, guys. If you're on the camera, there it is. Look at how that's a nice one. Holy cow. In the water. Now I'm gonna go try to find my wife a chair. As you guys can see, I switched back to a good old Ned crawl. This one's blue, so I hope it actually entices a hit looking having more of a bluegill color. Got him. Got him. Look at that, guys. Got ourselves a bass. Look at that. Nice bass. I'm gonna get him back in the water. Thank you, Jesus. Go get your. Whew, that was a good one. Well, so I know what I'm using on these guys from now on. These blue cross with the feathers. Well, there's a little bass going after it. Got him. Hopefully I was recording. Oh man, he swallowed that. Got ourselves a... Well, large mom bass, if I could pick them up. Little large mom bass. Let's we'll see what's in there. Caught a little blue go. Oh man, right through your eye. That sucks, brother. I'm sorry. He had it in his mouth.
got him. Wow, did he go after that. Well, I know which bait I'm using every time. Man, did he go ham on this? Where was he at? I see ya. Ooh, he almost hit it on reaction. Got him. Short time. Whew, I really ripped him up. There's two. Thank you, Jesus. Look at that. It's a nice bass. Got two of them here in a few seconds. <laughs> 